welcome to my channel Narc Delusion. My name is Nicole. Today I want to talk to you about when you think back to when you first met the narcissist. They were casting for their movie roles. They were looking for their bit players. Narcissists are always casting for their fantasy movie. When you think back, they were auditioning you. You could tell that they were examining something about you. They were scoping you out. Can you support their movie? Will you allow them to be star of the show? This is what the narcissist wants to know. They want to know what can you do for them. This is what they're looking for. When they first met you, they quickly determine if you can play the roles of a bit player where they are the star. They want to know if you will suit that role. The roles have been unfilled and they have been empty for far too long already. The bottomless narcissist has been looking for you. The narcissist has been waiting for you like a predator. You are not in a mutual normal relationship. The narcissist has nothing to give but directions and also their games. They want to run your life. They want to direct your behavior. They want to control all of your time. They will not give you anything. You will get nothing because you are just a bit player in their fantasy. You are just a bit player in their movie. The narcissist has been repeating these dysfunctional behaviors for most of their life. It hasn't worked out well for them, but they still don't think they should change. They are placing the blame on you. Any failures is your fault. They saved their face. They saved what they want to portray by pointing fingers at you. Every single person has failed them. All these other people failed them before you. And the narcissist has a lot of bodies buried everywhere from their past. You are to pour all your energy and resources into them. Because this is the reason why the narcissist is around you. The narcissist is a taker. The narcissist has no plans to give you anything. The narcissist is a predator. They targeted you for their purposes. All they want to do is take from you. If you stay in this fantasy movie with them, they will take and use you and take everything from you. And when you do not have any resources left, when you are drained of everything that you can do, then they will find another bit player for their movie. The narcissist is the director of this fantasy movie. They have casted you in a fantasy about themselves. Often the narcissist is good looking. This is how they get away with these games for so long. The narcissist likes to use alternative facts. They have a fake reality. This is their defense mechanism against life. The narcissist created a false reality, a delusion that they want to trap you in. If nobody is in there with them, they get lonely and nobody believes what they're trying to portray. So they want to capture people and keep them in there with them in this delusional movie. Everyone has their roles. The narcissist has severe PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorder that they did not resolve from an abusive and neglectful childhood. Oftentimes, they were very much neglected, especially their emotions. Then on the other hand, they were pampered, such as lots of gifts, for example, or any achievements or being good looking, but their emotions were still neglected. That is why it is so hard for the narcissist to drop their act. The narcissist is surviving by hiding behind their false facade. 
they are abusive and defensive because they are protecting their delusion. Often this mask is all that they have. Many are good looking and they use this to their advantage. That is the plan from the beginning. You thought you were meeting a normal person. A narcissist is far from normal, but they will give you the image. They will give you the image that they're like everyone else, just better. Narcissists want to act like they're good people and many donate to charity. Narcissists will act like they have morals. Future faking is one of their favorite tactics. They know if you didn't believe that you would just leave. Narcissists do not have any morals because it is all about them. You are a mere bit player that they've cast in their lame movie. They will replace you with another actor as soon as they've drained all of your resources. What's funny is if you want to bother a narcissist, just save something that you don't tell them about and just tell them later that you have it. That will shock them because they thought they took everything from you. You will be replaced because you failed and you will be replaced quickly. You will be abused, devalued, and shamed. The narcissist does not accept any responsibility for the relationship being a disaster because the director is never wrong. You fail to perform properly in their movie. The narcissist will shift all blame and fault onto you and they will move on to their next supply. On top of that, they will use you to triangulate with the other supply. You will be replaced as fast as possible because their show must go on. They usually want to trap you quickly because they have immediate and pressing needs. A narcissist has a lot of needs that they cannot meet themselves. Narcissists need you to accomplish their goals for them. They want to just sit there like a movie director. The narcissist just wants to sit in the director's chair and order you around. Like a director, the narcissist wants to watch you. Narcissists like to watch. That's another reason why the narcissist stalks you. They want to scare you. They want to show their power. They want to see if they could detect what your moods are from a distance. They want to know, are you performing to their directions? Are you playing your role that they assign to you? The narcissist has cast you in their lame movie.